Hello YouTubers, today I'm going to set up my wood miser sawmill. I brought it down here yesterday and just set it there, but really I haven't done any setup on it yet. I have to level it and then we're going to get it fired up and see if, how it runs and make sure everything works and then the next step is going to be to start cutting logs up. So. I'm going to go over and start leveling this thing up, so talk to you later. All right, now I'm gonna start the the engine, and I got to raise the, the head up over the the arms, the lifting arms, and bring it back. I got to get the weight off that end so I can put the outriggers down and level it. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I got to get it started. So gotta get to it.
All right, let's uh, do a little walk around here. I got the, uh, now this is the front of it. Got the tow hitch here. The controls are there. That's my earmuffs lying on top there. Anyway, then we have a winch, table winch here, if we need it. And I have used it once in a while. Not to load logs, but actually to pull the saw out of the, I couldn't get it out of where I had it. But, but this is uh, what we got. And the outriggers, lifting arms, whatever you want to call them. Oh, they're lifting arms, actually. The outriggers are just black ledge coming down here. And, and that's probably about it. The fenders come off. I got them laying here. I'll probably put them in the shop. But that's probably pretty much it around here. And you don't see it much anymore. I don't know why. I guess my people just don't want them. But uh, I do have a an operator seat with this, and that's it there, and I love it, because every time I walk down here with this, I end up hitting my shins on that hunk of steel right there, and it hurts, so I'm very glad, that's why I like that, try to be careful, but then you forget. So anyway, that's about it for now. Uh, the next thing is, I guess, to get a log on here. Uh, probably won't be today. I have some other things to do here, but we'll get back for you on this. Catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit thumbs up and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Need all the help I can get. And here's the, this mill has nine hundred and thirty hours on it. It's a nineteen ninety two model. So it's got some years behind it. Been a good machine. So we'll get back to you on this later.